Yeah, I'm Jim. You're Jim? Okay, I'm Ted. All right. You suck at fishing. My boat's better than your crab trap. <laughs> oh, oh, I did all that hiking and you just sat around here this whole time? <laughs> oh, you got me. Your shelter sucks. Oh. 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 Out of the TKO. ring. TKO. Out of the ring. Jim for the win. Hi, I'm Zachary Fowler, winner of Alone Season 3, and Luke Soderling here today to join me to watch uh, Alone Season 4, Episode 10, the final episode, two teams left. We're going to watch it, you can watch our reactions, and then we're going to, I'm going to teach Luke how to teleport, and we're going to teleport up okay. on out of here to a new location, and talk about what we thought of it all. So, let's watch it. Alright. Gotta do snacks. You always gotta have snacks. Okay. Coffee. You always have your coffee. Yeah. yeah. Coffee's overrated. Is this thing starting? Helps if I hit play. Alright, there we go. <laughs> stomp. Yeah. What's that thing called, called stomp or whatever? Yeah, you know, the, it's like Dance Dance Revolution there. Yeah. The eels. He's doing oh. the Dance Dance Revolution on the eels that he found under the rocks. He is the toughest old guy, I think. So wow. Outside of, um, so much. Oh, what's his name, from Mountain Men. Oh, yeah, um, uh, I can't remember his name. This episode has been brought to you by Fowler's Makery of Mischief.com, t-shirts, slingshots, shovels, and the new survival bracelets from Wazoo and Fowler Orange, linked below and at the end. I could probably eat the ass end out of a hobby horse right now. Ah, <laughs> that's gross. <laughs> What's a hobby horse? Isn't that one of those little rocking horses? Or like a, well, or is yeah. he talking about an actual pony? I think he's talking ass, about a pony. I eat the ass end of a pony. <laughs> I, I'd be hating it if I had to miss Christmas. Uh, I don't know if I could have done it. Yeah. That's the only thing that, because I love Christmas. Yeah. And that's when Jamie and I got married. You know, and, and oh, with the kids. I've I mean, almost, man, I've, I've only ever yeah. missed like two Christmases with my family in Vermont. Mm. Day 70, I'm starting to bite my nails. How long? Oh no. Are they gonna beat your record? Are they, can they make it to day 87? <laughs> no one can suffer like we can. There's a claim to fame. That's where they put the game face on. You know, they're coming to do a med check. You wash your face for That's the first it. time in a couple weeks and you and you get all Pinch like, your cheeks and try to you, you put your firewood pile up high. You put the you put the teapot on. We for, can still do it. We pot can still on make for tea it. And, and you try to put, wear all your clothes. Y yeah. <laughs> or I can. Re <laughs> <laughs> oh, Woo! Oh, my oh man. Right? <laughs> that just reminds me of. I got something in my eye. You got, uh, is, yeah, no, it's dusty in here, man. It's dusty. Oh man! Uh, <laughs> it reminds me of the last day I had. An horrific feeling of torture, like to take it off your sweater. I won't be. I don't think I'll ever be able to watch loved ones come up behind somebody ever again without that feeling. That's like <laughs> it reminds you of your own. Yeah. <laughs> they are yelling. <laughs> Didn't know I need a box of things. Right. Ah. <laughs> uh, uh, Oh man, congratulations guys. Wow, good, good job guys. Good job, there both go. teams there yeah, at the end. No, Holy sure. cow. Amazing. <laughs> there's, the, <laughs> there's the yelling. <laughs> what an end to Ted and, Ted and Jim's excellent adventure, man. Wow. Wow. <laughs> What uh, an adventure! That's amazing. Oh, they did such an awesome job. I am, I am so impressed. You know, they went through such a struggle. Yeah, man. you know, fighting and then, and then recovering from it, and and uh, which is a testament to their resilient resiliency. You yeah. know, that they struggle and get knocked down and get back up and fight and then get back together. And I mean, it's just that's real life. That's just the way things are. So that was a great episode. Yeah. We're gonna we're gonna do my thing that we always do. I'm gonna teleport on out of here, and we'll talk about it in new location. You ready? All right. And sure. just remember, think about the new location, squeeze the brain muscle, All right. and uh, you'll be there. Okay. Here, wait, get ready. All right. So.
Here we go, ready? Yep. One, two, three. Ah, I'm still here, it didn't work. Ah, no good at this. Come on, Zach, it didn't work. Oh, it didn't work that time. All right, so we'll try it like this. I'll, okay. send, I'll send you, ready? There we go, all right, now my turn. Where is he? All right, go back and get him. Ah, there's gotta be a better way to do that. Hey, there you are. Yeah, all right. <laughs> we I both made it. Yeah, we made it. <laughs> all right, wow. A lone season, what was that? That last, last episode, wow, you that was, know? That was rough. It, it's rainy out here. Yeah. What the no. heck, huh? <laughs> go back inside, it's almost like we're on the show. <laughs> There we go. Us? Yeah, there we go. All right, we're back. All right. Uh, yeah, it's like almost like we're out there with them, huh? Yep. Identifying with all that rain. Well, watching this episode really kind of brought me back. You know, you start watching some of those things, especially the end. I mean, man, it just it gets you. It just reminds you of how rough that was and how emotional that reuniting was, right? Yeah. Yeah. There was a lot of dust in the room after that moment there. Yeah, right. right. Yeah, getting was, uh, some of that. I shouldn't have, shouldn't have dusted the uh, office before we watched that. Stirred moment. it all up. It was getting Stirred all over it all the place. Up. And we're yep. blurring right out as fast as we can say it. Oh well. So yeah, what do you think, man? What do you think? They, man, I mean, they toughed it out. I mean, Pete and Sam. Holy cow. What a team. I mean, when they were at, we started the episode at like day 50, and then you jump ahead to day 65, and you saw the difference in Pete's face just that last 15 days. Here, let's swing around to the other side, maybe if we're, if we're on uh, the leeward side of oh, the storm, yeah. the camera can uh, stay drier. Now it's blowing in my face. Yeah. Excellent. Not in the, at least it's not blowing in the camera's face, right? That's, that's the important part. That's right, yep. <laughs> we're suffering for you guys right now. Hope you appreciate it. It's Maine. We're, I'm used to this. What are you yeah, talking right. about? Yeah. No, I'm from nice northern Minnesota where we get, you know, only it's 40 below for weeks on end. Beautiful and, and sunny all the time. That's right. Yeah, all right, but exactly. we, we digress. <laughs> I, I, I think here. it was I think it was pretty awesome. You know, yeah. just like any other season alone, it ended really well. Yep. These guys really had a good showing. I did not expect it to go that many days, so I think no. in some ways, like they proved me right and they proved me wrong. Because at the beginning I said that Two people couldn't do this for a long ah, period of time, right. and they are so degraded at the end of this, both oh, teams. Man. But at the same time, they made it so long, and it, like four people making it that many days in, 70 days in, is actually a record in itself. That right. four people made it 70 days to get all, you know, like that. It's 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 a little bit more than well, you other see, seasons. You see where it worked and where it didn't. Yeah. Some teams it worked for having two people, and those are the teams, those are the, really the, the three teams that made it the longest were the ones that, as a pair, worked really well together. Yeah. And then everybody else, as one would drop off, you know, because they were either the weaker member, or they got hurt, or sick, or whatever happened to them, that was almost a detriment yeah. in some cases. So it yeah. really went both ways. It was, it was hard to call. But great finish for everybody that was out there, you know, good job, guys. Yeah. Oh, congratulations. Awesome. Well done. Congratulations. Yep. Uh, Jim and Ted's excellent adventure was yeah. definitely most excellent, I'd it, say. It was the most excellent adventure, yeah. for sure. Yeah, no, it, it was awesome. The only thing I was a little bummed about is they didn't show anything cleverly new for these guys. It was all that review of everything else that happened. And, you know, I, I was hoping to see some more clever things pulled out at the end. But I think at this point, they had all settled into the routines. Yeah. Like Dad was saying, he hates his routines there. Right. It's like oh, the, man, it was just the collect the food, do the yep. firewood every day. And it was a monotony for them. Yeah, it was kind of painful. It, it gets really a drudge near the end there and uh, it doesn't make the best TV. Yeah. You know, it's just sitting yeah. around boiling water and well like on the on day 75 uh, Ted says uh, I think it was Ted said well today we're gonna you know get water and hopefully get a fish. Yeah. And that's it. That was the yeah. plan for the entire day was just to get some water and hopefully get a fish. Yeah. So it was, it was the, down um, to bare minimum at that point. So what was your favorite moment? Favorite moment? Oh, when of the, the entire series. I of guess. the entire series. Yeah. Um, oh, I, I really liked uh, Brooke and Dave's uh, shelter and hearth. 
Yeah, you know? that was just that was just really awesome. I really like that. But seeing the the girlfriends coming at the end from behind, I mean, that's just that's that was just maybe the best, best yeah. moment. But yeah. the the favorite uh, favorite things I seen him doing, you know, is those crab traps, both on yep. broken. Uh, and Dave's crab trap and and the boys' crab trap is too bad they lost it. Yeah, and that, uh, and that boat. Yeah, that, right, boat, that was, boat was awesome. And it's too bad that didn't pay off for them, like going yeah, out there, like they started really benefited nailing some huge fishing because of it. You no. know? but nobody has. It's almost like I was gonna. Say, I called it before the curse of the boat, but actually they must have broke the curse of the boat. They did. Everybody else that boat made a boat before ended up going home because of their boat almost. Yeah. You know, and uh, it, it, so it's like they they totally broke that curse. It didn't pay off for them, but. Maybe it's a curse of the boat not paying off for you. Yeah, People right. trying to build boats and they just don't seem to pay off. What's interesting about unless it's a Duck Hunter 3000. The, <laughs> what's interesting about this season though is that the the ones the two that made it right to the end did not have a significant shelter. You know, I mean, Sam and Pete's shelter had little log walls up a little ways. You know, and that both was both of them were just simple lead. They were very but simple. But I think that's shelters. the nature of uh, Vancouver. Mm, you know, yeah. that you can get away with that. And they didn't realize there was a shelter building competition going on after watching season three because they didn't watch that until after they got home. Oh, really? So, yeah, I know, because that didn't oh, air. Because okay. you remember they were out there at Christmas. Oh, that's And that's right. when it was airing, season three was airing. So they oh, they right. missed out on all of that until they got home and oh, then got wow. to catch up on the episodes and, and watch our adventure. So yeah, right. it's like now the game is on. Season okay. four, everybody's going to probably have seen what the other this seasons season have. Four. The, okay, new season five. There we go. Everybody will have seen what's happened in the former episodes, and now that's going to be like game on. Season five. What do you think you, it's going to be? I, I have no idea. Yeah, I, you do. We we missed. No. Uh, I, there's actually. Well, we do know because there was a teaser. Yeah. For it on the thing, reunion or, or redemption, so. right? Yeah. A redemption uh, that's episode. That's what it seems like. And it sounds like uh, there's a lot of interesting people out there from the former seasons. Doing it again, I have no idea who they There's are. There's some people I'm, that are missing. I've, you I've know, heard you rumors. Kinda, yeah, right. If you yeah. follow them online, that all these people that this, from former episodes are missing right now. Yep, they're MIA, and you know that's a little suspicious. Where so. are they? What country is it? I that's don't know right. if it showed it in the teaser because we didn't catch the teaser. It didn't come up on Amazon when we watched it, but uh, they're talking about it on Reddit and everywhere yep. else. So. Right. So we'll see. I don't know. So look forward to a new season of Alone Season Five. Who knows where it's going to happen, and. I think that's all for me. That's all, I that's got, all yeah. for Fowler and Luke. Yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to subscribe and follow the other stuff we do. We've been yeah. doing some videos together since we've been hanging out. And we'll see you next time. See you guys. Bye. There you go. Take that, Ted. <laughs> take, take that, Jim. Take that. <laughs> yes, again. I think the redhead's defective. No, no this guy pops off. <laughs> yeah, all the redheads. <laughs> all the redheads are defective. <laughs> all right, we win.